Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're feeling like there's a little bit of deja vu going on, there is. I just finished filming this makeup look and I thought this is the perfect holiday look to share with multiple lip options. So today we are talking about drugstore lip options that are perfect for the fall time holiday season. Just because if you are like me, you are probably looking for the easy way to get glam because you're so busy this holiday that the perfect way to do it is just have a simple go-to eyeshadow look with different lip options. Like that's perfect. So let's talk about this lip option that I'm wearing first. This is a super, super cute option. It's kind of been like my go-to everyday lip option. So I have uh, on the NYX Suede Matte Lip Liner in the color Maison. These NYX lip liners are so good. They're like $7.99 each. I purchased them from CVS just because CVS has um, these like CVS bucks that you can earn, especially in their beauty section. So you get money back by buying a lot of these brands. NYX is one of them. So they have like buy two, get one free, buy one, get one free. And then on top of that, if you purchase $20 worth of NYX products, they gave me $10 back. So that was like pretty awesome. Um, anyways, so I use this, this liner with um, the Hank and Henry lip, matte satin lip in Lust. First of all, I need you guys to look at this packaging. This is the Hank and Henry uh, lipstick. Look at how pretty this lipstick is. Like, excuse me. Yes, and then we've got a little uh, Givenchy moment because it's got this button that like drops the lipstick and then you can pull it out. So it's super luxurious, super cute. And the formula is actually really long wearing. I've been enjoying wearing this a lot because I don't have to reapply the product multiple times. So the only thing that is not drugstore of this lip combo and what you'll notice that I do throughout this entire tutorial is I use one lip gloss over everything and it's this guy right here. So this is the Too Faced Peach uh, Cream Peach Oil Lip Gloss. I love this to top everything off. If your color is ever too dark and you kind of were going for a little more nude, throw this on. It's got some pigment of its own, which is okay to me because I want to again lighten colors up most of the time versus wearing a super dark lip but I love this lip gloss. I don't think that there's any other lip gloss that I've used as much as this one. So invest in a lip gloss, that's a really good one. The oil part of it, you can really feel a difference on your lips versus being tacky sticky. It's just very hydrating and plumping. So um, that's it for our first lip option. What do you guys think? I want you guys to rate these. So like do a uh, first lip option, one out of 10, give it a number in the comments down below to see how much you guys are liking the nudes versus the colors because we got it all in this tutorial today. All right, so I'm back with the second lip option. Again, this is a drugstore priced, um, drugstore, I wanna say drugstore pricing just because they're not found at drugstores doesn't mean that they're not in that price range. And so this is a combination of, again, NYX. You're gonna see a lot of NYX lip liners just because I haven't found a different drugstore liner that's as good as this one. I like the fact that they're sharpenable. I like the formula, I can fill in my whole lip without having it break on me. It's like amazing. So this is the NYX Suede Matte Lip Liner in the shade Cans. And then I topped it off with a Sephora Collection lipstick and this is in the shade number 24. Let me say this, when it comes to inexpensive matte lipsticks that are comfortable to wear, you will see two in this video that I use frequently because I love the formula. That is gonna be NYX and Sephora. This Sephora lipstick could stay on me all day. I don't care if I put lip gloss on over it or not. I did today just because I feel like, again, I've just been feeling the glossy lip for more of that holiday look. Um, and I love, love this formula. It's so pigmented, so good. It's not drying, doesn't have a weird scent to it. It's just so good. And this combo, you'll notice that if you get this cans, it is a little lighter than the lip color, although it doesn't look like it on camera, but it is. It's more of my lip color. And when I go dark like that, I do prefer to use something like a lip color to even things out because I don't want it to be super dark and I just kind of blend it in together. I topped it off with another gloss. It's not a drugstore. It's actually not even a gloss. It's supposed to be a balm and it's a Huda Beauty Silk Balm. I just put that over it just to kind of keep my lips looking luscious and going with the whole look. What do you guys think? Lipstick number two, comment down below and rate it one out of 10. This is a really cute, I like this. This is definitely Thanksgiving dinner 
All right, guys, so this is the third lip combo. It's a little lighter than the other one that we just did, but still pretty fall vampy. Um, this is honestly all a NYX lip liner. This is the shade Los Angeles, and honestly, this has to be my favorite lip liner of all time. As of right now, I've been using it almost every single day on its own with just lip gloss over it, and I love it. It is so good for the season. Look at how much I have left of it. It is, like, clearly, I love it. Um, and so this is honestly an ombre situation because I teamed it up with this lipstick. You guys can see how different that is. This is the NYX Lip Laundry in the shade Laced Detail. I am obsessed, obsessed with these two colors together. They look so good. They just give you enough of a differentiation that like 90s vibe of lip liner, you know what I mean? But it is just so pretty and it's so good. I love, 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 love this lip combo. So lip combo number three, what do you guys think? Rate it one to 10 below. All right guys, and the last lip color, which I know you knew this was coming, is a nice red. And this is a really good wearing red. Let me tell you that I wore it to a uh, party the other day and I didn't have to take the lipstick in with me because it stayed on until I wiped it off, honestly. And so these are both NYX products. The lip liner I use is the Matte Lip Liner in Kitten Heels. So pretty. I apply this to most of my lip just to kind of give it something to have underneath for when I'm, you know, drinking or eating or whatever. And then I also put on the NYX Slip Tees, uh, is that what it's called? Yeah, Slip Tees Full Color Lip Oil in the color Red Queen. And this is, so this is the last lip color that I have for you guys today. So that's four colors, four drugstore options for you guys to have during the holidays. That way you can know how to mix it up. Just get you a good look, girl, a good eyeshadow look. This one wouldn't be bad. I'll link it above just so you guys have the way to recreate this look because it's perfect for the holidays, whether it's Christmas, New Year's, or Thanksgiving. Like, this is a go-to look. I'm actually hosting a makeup class, a holiday makeup class inspired around a look that's very similar to this, and I think that you guys would really, really like it. So I'll link that above if you want to find out how to recreate this eyeshadow look. Let me know which option you guys thought was the best that you would actually wear to um, anywhere during the fall time so that I can, you know, know what you guys are thinking, where you guys are at. You guys know that I am personally a zero or like all or nothing type of girl, so I would most definitely do this or one of my nude options. So can't wait to hear what you guys think. Like always, subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up if you like this video. Don't forget to share the content, but please subscribe. We have goals to get to a thousand subscribers by 2021 and we're slowly doing that thanks to your support. So thank you and I love you. Bless you guys. See you guys next time.